Okay, so I realized that uh, the last part of this video that I filmed, I had a... Let me see if I could... I haven't filmed myself in quite some time. Hmm. So I realized that in the last part of this video that I filmed, uh, I had I had an iPhone and the USB port got messed up on it, so I had to take it into Apple. And when I did that, I lost the part where UBH was out here doing the survey and laying everything out. So I don't have that part of the video anymore. Uh, so this is kind of like the intro intro. I don't know what part I'm going to put this in. I know it's kind of convoluted, but yeah. So I was out here at our uh, property where our house is getting built. And so they've got the the flags laid out for where the house is going to go. I was working on the water, getting the water situation, water situation situated, if that makes sense. Uh, I got the power taken care of last weekend. And over there, you can see that's where our... Uh, our goats used to hang out. I built them like a little, um, like a little play area. But uh, that's been a long time since they've had that. But we don't have the goats anymore. So um, yeah, this is just kind of an update. So hopefully this week they are going to be starting on the foundation part of everything. So um, yeah, we'll get to that part when we get to it. Peace. Update number. Two. We have Kathy Ellis, who's attorney, and she was actually in the Supreme Court, in the courtroom so, on Tuesday for those oral arguments. We have this Supreme is our land, um, where we're building a house. I am really exhausted right now. I'm listening to podcasts in the background. So, um, I'm doing the water faucet right here. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to put this in the video or not. Let's focus on my... Hey, look at that. Um, doing the temporary faucet. I did the temporary electric over here. We're going to have a house uh, going in. Let me walk over here. Show you guys. So here's the meter. And I've got temporary power for the builders. Uh, I've got 110 and 240. I just had my saws all hooked up because I was cutting some wood to drive into the ground over there. So it's getting late in the day, running out of daylight. So uh, I'm going to try and finish this up. And uh, yeah, this is update like two, maybe. I'll explain more later that I'll put in the beginning of the video. Okay, how's everybody doing? Uh, I've got an update for you guys here. Um, I'm at our property that we're having uh, a house built and uh, they have laid the concrete and they have started framing on the house. So I'm just going to do like a pre-tour uh, thing right here. So <clears throat> we're going through a company called UBH and uh, it is something that is going to be a 90% build. So I just walked over a piece of plastic so <clears throat> they've got some of the stuff staged here uh, the wood for the roof uh, I've got some there's windows in there there's shingles over there uh, so right now if you're looking at it this is the front door and the front porch and they've smoothed out the inside part of the concrete and they're still doing the framing uh, right now but it kind of started to rain a little bit today so I don't know if they got as much done as they wanted to so um, so this is gonna be this is the living room area over here's the kitchen there's an there's gonna be an island there uh, over there's the dining room and then right here's the hallway we've got <clears throat> one bedroom right here this is gonna be our office this is another uh, bedroom which will eventually maybe be my kids room this is the bathroom area right here and it's windy I apologize and then over here is the third bedroom or fourth bedroom however you want to look at it uh, 
So, this is the hallway. Let me go back over here. This is the living room. Uh, over here is the back, the back porch, which I'm really excited about this because now I can have a place to put my griddle, my uh, cookout stuff, you know, an extra grill or something like that. We're gonna have a dining table over here and uh, we've got the view of the backyard with the pond. Um, so if I go back over here, it's just is not the door, it's a window. And over here in this one, we have the pantry or what's gonna be the pantry. And then over here is the hallway. This is going to be the utility room, which is washer dryer, hot water heater is gonna go inside that little area. <clears throat> the only thing I'm a little confused about is, so this is just a storage room. Uh, it doesn't have any specific purpose, just except for storage. But for some reason they put the hot water heater attachments uh, for everything that's coming in right here uh i'm not totally sure why they did this um because it's supposed to be in that room so they're gonna have to run it through the wall which is kind of strange but i don't know that much about building houses so maybe they have a reason for it uh this is the master bedroom <clears throat> i've got or we've got one uh walk-in closet right here uh and then over here is the this is where the sink will go the countertop for the bathroom <clears throat> toilet walk-in shower area it's like a four by four i think and then this right here is what i am the most excited about which i will be doing a separate video at some point so this is going to be my server room slash my closet so <clears throat> what I'm planning is I haven't decided exactly where I'm gonna put my server rack I don't think I'll be able to put it there I think I'll have to put it right here so <clears throat> so right there is gonna be where my server rack will go and um, I, don't, I don't know which way I'm gonna position it because I'll have to access both sides and then I'm gonna run it you know run all the Ethernet cable up through to the to the uh, roof in the attic and then you know have drop downs wherever it is that I need to have them and then what I'm gonna have in here at some point uh, I'm not exactly sure how I'm gonna do it maybe right here I will have where all my clothes will go you know have a maybe like a dresser and then you know two hanging uh, things uh, two like two rods. I know I'm trying to talk and then what I want to have is like a small table Where I can have like my camera station photography station or just like a little maybe like a small desk where I can have You know like a, a monitor to access all my server stuff and, and all that um, <clears throat> I'm not totally sure how I'm gonna do it quite yet uh, I've got you know I've got options uh, you know just kind of standing here and thinking about it real quick I'll come back to that so <clears throat> anyway so yeah this is just kind of a pre preliminary tour got the window here so if you guys see we're gonna have I'm not totally sure exactly what this is yet this is some sort of load beam or something that may go across a big portion of the of the roof like I said, I don't know that much about building houses. Uh, you can see, I think we got some of our siding right there. Um, or maybe it's trim. I'm not totally sure yet. Over here we've got all the shingles for the roof. And then these right here, these cedar uh, uh These are the uh, columns that are going to be like on the front door entrance area. We've got... <coughs> Uh, tr edge trims and stuff like that. Uh, there's some more cedar blocks underneath this. <clears throat> and then just more wood for the roofing and all that. And it's getting windy again. 
<clears throat> and then under here, we've got the windows. All the windows that are going in. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah, I think I'm going <clears> to <throat> end this here. So I know next they're going to be starting on the uh, roof. Well, they're, they're going to finish the framing, and then they'll start on the framing for the roof. So uh, I know stuff on that piece of freaking plastic again. Get out of here. I know at some point I need to come back and add some conduit inside of the walls for running Ethernet cables to some you know specific locations that I want things. So yeah, it's it's going. It looks like it's it's starting to pick up um, pace for this. All of this happened within the span of the last two weeks. Because two weeks ago, nothing was here except for just dirt. So they've accomplished a lot in two weeks. And we'll just have to keep monitoring it and seeing how, how well they do. But yeah. See you guys later.